Hey guys, welcome back. I'm with Jeff Bullock, our tire specialist from Hankoop Tire. Now Jeff, we all know that there's an array of performance tires out there. Can you tell me a little bit more about them? Sure, there's lots of performance tires in the market today, but I like to put them into three categories. The first category is the sport performance looking tire. Now that tire generally carries a lower speed rating. Its handling characteristics are a little less than the performance tires, but the plus side to it is it usually lasts longer and it's usually priced a little lower. The second category is the performance tire category. It generally carries higher speed ratings than the sport type tire, usually in the H range. Its handling characteristics are a little better. The mileage is a little less than the sport, but better than the ultra high performance tires. And it's about a middle of the road as far as pricing goes. The third category is the ultra high performance tire category. It generally carries the top three speed ratings, W, Y, and Z. It has superior handling characteristics. The tread life is a little lower, but it tends to be lower because without tread wear, you're not going to get those superior handling characteristics. So that's the three categories. How do you compare the three of them? Do you use UTQG? Yes, you do use UTQG. UTQG stands for Uniform Tire Quality Grading, and it's a DOT-required labeling system that rates the tires against a controlled tire on a specified track in performance categories such as tread wear, traction, and temperature. Now, the tread wear category, they're assigned numbers. A tire that has a tread wear of 400 generally lasts twice as long as a tire that has a tread wear rating of 200. In the traction category, we rate that tire in four letter sizes, double A, A, B, and C, with double A being the best and C being the worst. That rates the tires in its ability to stop in a straight line on wet pavement. It doesn't rate the tire in its ability to corner or do any maneuvering on wet pavement, just its ability to stop in a straight line on wet pavement. The third category that we rate the tires in is temperature. Temperature ratings are at A, B, or C, with A being the best and C being the worst. Temperature is the tire's ability to dissipate the heat that it builds up. So your budget actually plays a large part in the type of tire you end up selecting, right? Sure. To, to select the tires, your budget is always important. Like I said, the sport performance looking tire generally tend to be a lower price and fits in, would probably fit into everybody's budget or someone with a lower budget, where the ultra high performance tend to be a little more money. You definitely get a good product and a superior handling tire, but you pay a little more money to get that. So it really is a balancing act between the type of tire that you want and the type of tire you can afford. You sure, know? it's a real balancing act. Budget to what you're looking for in a tire. You got to think of both ends and put the two together and make a purchase. Great. Thanks, Jeff. You're welcome. We'll be right back with more Sport Compact TV.